case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1962, an intriguing case unfolded that cast a spotlight on First and Fourteenth Amendment rights and the technicalities of libel laws. L.B. Sullivan, a then commissioner in Montgomery, Alabama, sued the New York Times Company and four individuals for alleged libel in an ad, catapulting the case into the Alabama Supreme Court. The crux of the lawsuit revolved around a false advertisement published by the New York Times. Sullivan claimed the ad targeted him as a member of a specific group, actively sowing seeds of defamation. He called for a retraction alongside the governor of Alabama. Further constituting the evidence pool was a collection of 49 articles provided by staff correspondents of the Times from Alabama, including notable reports covering the Civil Rights Commission hearings and the Martin Luther King trial. The defendants argued against the appropriateness of personal jurisdiction and the method of service. However, much to their chagrin, the lower court dismissed these arguments as irrelevant. Instead, they held the New York Times responsible for the advertisement's content. The defendants, in fact, essentially waived their objection to the service of process by making a general court appearance. The lower court ruled in favor of Sullivan, awarding him a hefty $500,000 in damages. The New York Times appealed this decision, leading the case to the Alabama Supreme Court. Upon review, the court dismissed some appellant claims due to inaccurate legal terminology. With a firm hand, they upheld the lower court's decision, citing U.S. Code Title 28, Section 1652 to assert the primary publication was not the locus of the libel. The damages awarded remained unaffected, sustained by a palpable presumption of the verdict's accuracy. The Alabama court endorsed the ruling, and the decision was met with accordance by the Chief Justice and Justices Simpson and Merrill. All in all, New York Times Company v. Sullivan was more than a libel suit. It was a pivotal examination of the constitutional balance between public interest and personal reputation. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.